Shall we begin? Hi there guys, Rico here from Rico Sizzles. We're back. It's been a long while. COVID has taken its toll. Plans were made, plans has fell through, but we move on. So, myself and Bedarf pulling into Caledon right now. Nice little beautiful city on the, the city town on the garden route. And uh, this is where we're going to be spending the next couple of days. So, yeah, if you find yourself on the garden route, pop into Caledon. I promise you, you won't regret it. Beautiful little town. Okay, so we've been here before, right? And there's this one place that you have to visit when you're in Caledon. It's a little family owned restaurant called Fat Henry's, right? And They've been here for years. A real pillar in the community where good food is concerned. Now, what we've seen with Fat Henry and through our previous conversations is that all the ingredients are locally sourced. So, farm to table, essentially. Fresh produce, fresh meats, just all around fresh ingredients. So, let's get to the restaurant. Here we are, this is Fat Henry's, right? Number 10, Hope Street, Caledon. Um, yeah, without further ado, let's go in and go see what is on the menu. So, before we continue, please note that this is in no way sponsored. We are paying for our meal um, as we believe that we like to support small businesses, especially after the pandemic that we've just been through. Then, let's get into the Buddha pizza that I just had delicious fresh ingredients which can give you a breakdown it is burvos, bultam, cheese, peppers, barbecue sauce and obviously the cheese now excuse me um, this is not the first pizza that we've having or that we've had at Pat Henry's. Yesterday for supper we had what they call the blue billy which is blue cheese, bull tongue, figs and obviously now the cheese. Both pizzas are one of the best sellers and once again the freshness you are not going to get that anywhere else. What sits fat in there is a part here or a side here in Caledon. Um, amongst all the chain link eateries that are around is that all the ingredients are locally sourced. Budavos comes from the farm. Um, Bultang, we've got people that are speaking Bultang here, 
everything that you can think of is locally grown and sourced. Which is why freshness, there is not a problem with that. Our dessert has arrived. As you can see, this is the Belgian waffle made at Fat Henry's, served with a honey based syrup and some vanilla ice cream. Now, the portion that I have here is only half. Full portion is bigger, and my other half is having the other half of my waffle that was on the menu. Can tell you that everything is made fresh and enjoy. So, I'm gonna be going now. I need to get into all this goodness. Ah, cheers. So, it has come to my attention while speaking to the management of Fat Henry's is that. Even though they have come through a difficult period, right? If you are an essential service provider, police, um, nursing, correctional facilities, whatever, you produce your card, they still give you a further 10% off of your bill, which I find amazing because they've been through something difficult, yet they can still offer that service back to the to the workers serving the community and that that for me is camaraderie within your, in your, in your community and it's, it's something special if you think about it so yeah fat dinners people it's it's an amazing place you need to be there on your trip through the garden popping if you're coming from the George side towards Cape Town, coming from Cape Town towards George, whatever, wherever, you pass in Caledon, pop in 10 Hope Street, Caledon, fat enemies. They are literally about 300 meters away from the end too, so it's worth your while to come in. Thank you.